91.1 The Globe. It's your station for culturally progressive music, of course. 6.30 right now, bottom of the hour, about 40 here in Goshen. It's a very exciting day here in the Globe studios. My name is Seth. We got Here Nor There. They're the jam band from Amish Land, of course, in the studios, ready to play some tunes. They got about three songs for us, but we're going to get a little bit of an interview as well going. I'll ask you guys to go around first. We'll start with you, Avery. Introduce yourself, what you play, what we got going on here. Great. My name's Avery Glick, and I play lead guitar. Hey, what's up? I'm Cody Dale. I play the bass. Hey, I'm the other Dale, and I play the drums. Hey, my name's Rick, and I play the keyboards. Awesome. Well, it's a pleasure to have you guys in the studios. Thank you so much. It's part of our live music series here at the Globe. And so let's let's start off with some easy questions here. How did you guys get started together? And then how also did you guys get started in music, maybe, as well? Great. So as far as playing together, Cody and I started playing an acoustic duo Oh, back in 2018, and slowly kind of formed the group from there, adding Rick and Dale eventually. And then as far as uh, how we got started playing music, I've been playing music a long time. I uh, started piano when I was in first grade and taught myself guitar and kind of, yeah, that's kind of my story on that. Yeah, I mean, I played in band all through middle school and high school, and that's about it there, and then messed around with the bass ever since then. Uh, same deal with Cody. In fact, he and I kind of touched around in a little bit of a band back in the day mm. for funsies, but uh, just the same deal. I got bored with kind of back with where I was in life, and they kind of hit me up, and the rest kind of just fell together naturally. So. Yeah, that's great. I uh, I had started getting piano lessons right before my fourth grade year, and uh, it was all classically trained, and then after I went off uh, to college, I kind of fell off of it, but then kind of started hanging out with these guys, and started learning how to jam a little bit and yeah it's been a it's been a fun ride learning how to do all that stuff well so real question real quick question rick what's yeah. that like to go from like a classically trained background to uh starting to jam a little bit uh, uh it's very different i remember uh when my first day at jazz band in high school they were like trying to get us a solo yeah which you know with classical music it's just like what's on the page is yeah, what yeah. you play so i had no idea how to do that and it's it's been a bit of a learning curve but you know i feel like we're we're starting to get there and figure it out well let's talk a little bit about that uh, little moniker that you guys kind of put out there the jam band from amish land where does that come from like what's the what's the backstory behind that sure well we grew up all of us except for eric who grew up in albion we all grew up in lagrange indiana um and so yeah we've been around amish folks our whole life and instead of kind of just trying to shy away from our roots we've tried to embrace it and say that you know that's who we are and we're a little bit different, but uh, like like country lumber, a little bit different, but a whole lot better. <laughs> yeah. we, we, we like to think so, and we, we have a lot of fun doing it. And so, I, yeah. Absolutely. And so, real quick, over on your Facebook, you have a, sort of a description of your group, including the genres rock, funk, bluegrass, reggae, and jazz. I think I got those all, but if there are more, <laughs> please let me know. Where did all those genres come from? Like, where are you guys just compiling music that you're each interested in, or is it a sort of combined interest in some artists or musical genres? I think a lot of that love for a diversity of genre comes from um, the bands that we love, uh, especially, you know, the Grateful Dead and Fish and other jam groups, String Cheese Incident, so many more that have really combined all those genres together. And so not only that, we do it, you know, um, just from our love of all those different genres too. And and even though that's the kind of music we like, we also, I, you know, the guys in the band, we all have different stuff that we really love. Mm -hmm. um, and but yeah, I think trying trying out lots of different styles allows us to um, to just have a lot of fun and, and, and try different things. So. Well, let's talk about this first song that you're about to play for us. What is this song's title? What's it about? Uh, when did you guys write it? That sort of thing. Sure. This song is called River Falls, and I wrote it um, when I got back from Spain. Um, and it's kind of talking about moving home and. Um, it's actually about uh, we love going down the Pigeon River all together, kayaking. And so oh. it's kind of a uh, description of that experience and, and being with friends and family that you really love. Absolutely. Well, let's get into it. It's River Falls by Here Nor There, live at the Globe Studios. <laughs> I was 
freeing up my mind from rehearsing situations that was such a waste of time. There's a way up on the shoreline, laughter in the leaves. I resume my meditation. I relish the comedy, cause I'm going down to where the river falls. I'm going down just to ease my where I belong. With the sun, capture me in rapture. The cage I come undone, and the whirlpools I was leaving went wrapping around my mind. In a swirling of the senses, talking that tragic glass of time. I'm going down to the river fall. Going down just to my mind going down back where I belong. Says uh, here nor there, live at the Globe.